Hi, John here. This is called Manahi Back. Manahi just call me. Sorry, Manahi, I was in the bathroom. Manahi. Hello? Manahi, give me a call back. Uh, Okay. We received a new voice mail. I listen to the message dial to the screen. I'll just ring him again. Um, trying to call you. Hang on, just hold a second. Trying to call you. Trying to call you. Money. Oh, on, money. <laughs> I missed you again. Uh, I was in the bathroom. I've been at the script. Hello? Hello? Money. Oh, he's gone. Hello? I missed you before because I was in the bathroom. I, I just come back from the swimming pool, had a feed, and uh, I did a hundred laps today in the pool. <laughs> and 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 six of them were underwater with my flippers and my goggles, one way, one breath, all the way, six times, out out of a hundred. So I've got my, my I pushed the medication aside and going to go full ball Be, because I know where my problem is, Manahi. It's the computer screen and all the all the magnetic fields around my head uh, well, for a long, long time, and I've been eating with the microwave um, and some more radiation. So I'm. Um, my head is blasted with microwave. That's why it's got black blood up there. When I go, to, when I go to cupping, all my back is red. My down my spine is red, and my buttocks is red. But my head is all black. And, and it's toxins, not from the food, like the Chinese girl. She's acupuncture. She said, no, it's not the food. It's something else. And that something else is the screen, where like mobile phones are the same too. It goes, it goes straight in your head. And so now I, now I gotta get some copper, like wires, and put it in my hat. Put it in my hat. When I, and put a hat on to to uh, cancel it, right? Oh, I. You, you gotta put copper. And, and that'll do the trick when you're in front of the computer or with a mobile phone. Uh, uh, so, money, um, I, had, I had a read. Oh, you got a cold. Yeah, I know. I just come outside. Yeah. Oh, I hope you don't not talk out in the cold because you might catch a cold outside. Is it all right? Uh, oh, oh, I see. I see. You you are up north. Yeah, I'm up 
What's that? Oh, I see, I see. I, well, I won't keep you out in the cold too long. Um, yeah. I've just been through everything. It's similar to what I went to England, and uh, um, uh, Charles Hirschfeld had set me all up to go. He he yeah. he cleared it to go and for me to get sixteen million pound. And yeah. I think it. I can only say that it was from my brother, living in Wolverhampton. And these lawyers had picked it up over there, and and uh, and uh, Lloyd's Bank, and they ah. they contacted me through uh, LinkedIn, you know LinkedIn, and with a yeah. business. That's where they contacted me, and but they have stolen it, and the CIB ah. CIB here caught them, caught them ah. caught them, but they won't can't do anything here. I've got to go there and do it to get the sixteen million pound back. In the in because that's what I was going there for the in the HM Treasury. When I got to Malaysia, that's when it all went haywire. Those two had duped me, duped me to go there, and then but they had got the documents out of here, over to Malaysia, and then they took that money. It was it was I've gone through it, but I see yours. I see your one. I don't think that has happened to you yet because you haven't made a move and now I know what to do. To, to, to put yours through and to put mine through so that I'd get you to do my one like how you, you did uh, and, and set it up. Uh, but if I, I'm trying to wait for Charles Hirschfeld uh, because I get the money to pay him to set it back up again. That was that was back in 2012. That's that's I was going I was going on my way to HM Treasury, and to the so you've got the other bank uh, Barclays, and I I know all the banks how they work, from the experience, of of the land transaction here. Uh, it's the same. We we all have those claims, uh, sitting there, but. Um, but uh, we'll go back over it again, uh, Manahi. But I'm familiar with your your one, and know how know how to how to see it through to make sure there's no gonna, not going to be on the other anybody on the other end to muck it up. Yes. Yeah, so we'll um, leave it that with me for for this few days, and I'll and I'll I'll, I'll put my head around it. We'll go back over it again when I come and see. Or before the thirtieth, in any, anyway. I've got time to, um, when you're back here, or, or, or no, you won't be back here, sorry, you're up there. Uh, I'll, I'll, I'll send something back, an email to you, um, just to um, let you know. I've got contacts over there, you see, they can check out. I've got the, I've, yeah, I've got somebody in, 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 uh, in, uh, in Brighton. Uh, he's running the our, um, Maui King William Party, the political party over there, and I've got the other one in Scotland up the road from uh, Edinburgh, where all our titles are, our, our birth certificates titles. But th the one with the HM Treasury, it's a straight-in case there, through, with the banks. That those documents are right, but no one else here has done any of that. They can't. They can't do it without titles. Um, and, 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 and you're the only one that's close closest out of anybody, and that's private. That what what I do with you is private. We have to make sure it works first uh, through the church, through 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 the through the Ratana Church. That's why I've stuck with the Ratana and Moi, and the Saint Mary's Church. Those two churches will will have certification on the other end. To justify who you are and who I am, the um, my brother bent in one or he was a, a walker. Well, that's a dominant name, but his his uh, his father was uh, Rangihuna. He, he he was a yeah Rangihuna, and then um, um, the mother married my dad um, and uh, Kamaya Kaika. Um, uh, uh, not sorry, not not. Um, uh, not Kamaya Kaika, sorry, um, uh, my, my own mother um, uh, Mar uh, was Rangihunas before, and that's a half-brother. Benton, a half-brother, was he, he was the school teacher in Tiki Tiki, right? So, so he, he's got something set up over there, and it's similar, 
That's the one I think these, these lawyers told me I have a claim over there. I think they picked it up because I don't think the family could touch it over there. Uh, uh, only the families, only the ones in the trust, right? Um, we're in the trust. Hello? Yeah, we're in that trust that where that money goes, the Queen Victoria Trust, um, and, and any money that's in the Treasury. But I'll leave it with me, uh, Manahi, I'll let you get out of the cold. Uh, but that's the latest. I've got people contact on the other end, and I'll follow up on my brother's um, 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 uh, thing, the same as yours. Okay? Hello? Okay, Manahi. It's, it's out of range. Okay, Manahi. Bye. 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 That's Manahi. He's got a bit bad uh, reception, but we have something private going on, so I won't talk about any of that. Uh, all, all i say to you is, that's why I was going to HM Treasury in 2012, because I, I, I had a direct line through to there, through these um, Martin Cicluna. Uh, he's the uh, bank manager from Lloyd, uh, Lloyd's Bank and uh, um, Falconer, Julian Falconer was the lawyer I paid to do my case over there. Those two found me on LinkedIn with my business profile and I, I'm sure, I've got to check up like how money he does, I'm sure they picked up my brothers, my half-brothers, birth certificate then ran with the 16 million. That's where the 16 million comes from, my half-brother, in living in Wolverhampton, in uh, Britain, or uh, England. Uh, that, that's where that uh, uh, claim comes from, similar to Manahi's. And that's not going to be shown to anybody, because that'll set this whole thing alight with the St. Mary's Church in Tiki Tiki, see, my brother was a school teacher in Tiki Tiki. He was adopted into Bill Walker's family, so his name changed to Walker, and then he changed it back to Wano, you see, because, <clears throat> like I say, his father was a Rangiruna, and my mother was on that side, then my father came along. I'm just telling you my story on who I am, um, that my father uh, uh, and my mother is Cook Island, uh, Kaika, and um, my father, Tahijun, and more or less not a Maori at this side of the titles, but native. Native? On the 1831, Tiki Tiki, saying Mary's Church, birth certificate, the first native title in this country. This is what I'm talking about, that people made a joke of it online, that I was talking riddles with 16 million claim. So I've got more than that with the Moai statue and the rest of the Pacific Island title standing in London that Maui statue. That's my Wānoa Royal Tahitian family. Okay, so for you people that have been giving me a hard time, all these years I have Manahi Parapara Mohini as the original title to New Zealand. Alright, I'm telling you, I've got control of that lot with them over the British title with them over there the native title original documents here for the Manukau company that put those titles together with Te Rawakato, Wharaherehere, Manukau over there in Britain. So just to let you know for the record that we are starting to see sense in who's who on these lands, not those Harawaras talking their heads off up there with the government and their Maori Party, and their Mana Party, and all the rest of it is 
on this side, the Queen's fake Maori, the true Moriori, Manukau, Wānoa, Maui, Parapara, Mohini title to this whole land that you are occupying, Harawira. You are occupying. I see your sweet words on there. That's about all you got. You got a big stack of people behind you with comments that support what you say. But you got no title. You can only whisper. You can't come into this court because it's Admiralty. Admiralty rules the whole world, Kai. It rules you on that land you occupy as an American, Hadfield. Now, all those people commenting on his name, on his Facebook site, I've left them, I haven't deleted them, I've left them there so you can see me having a crack at him and his family trying to rule this land that don't belong to them. They are only import bobby calves from America. There, I, I'd put the record straight, Kahi. Shut your mouth when I'm on that marae up there, Titi. How dare you say to me, don't bother coming. I say to you, get the fuck off out of that land because it's not yours. It's Kingy's. That's his land with that marae on it that got a pakia in it. Henry Williams inside it. It's not a Maori, real Maori title with that 1840 obelisk outside it. That's yours. That's your title that King is going to boot off that land. And he has the right to boot you off that land with your marae that's built by Pakehouse. Out. Okay. You can go with it. That's what I'm saying. Don't give me a rough time. Well, he had a hard time trying to teach you fellow something. And you call him a snake and all sorts of names sitting there laughing his head off at you, useless pricks. Because you know what? He had the title. He's still got the title. I've got it here. He's left me as his executor. If you know anything about executives and you know anything about contracts and commercial trading banks, Kahi, you're still in the classroom with your sister, Hinefare, with a blackboard and a pen, trying to rewrite history that's already here in my room. Everything, everything to run this country with a you lot of barracks. I can say that. There's nothing you can say about it. You can't sue me. You can't take me to court because we are the court with this flag. And you shouldn't be flying that flag. It doesn't mean a thing to you. It's not your flag to do anything with other than run up and down the road and hold it for what reason? Nothing. It's got no mana in it. You see how dumb you lot are? Can't you? The whole fucking lot of you dumb Maori. I'll say this because ISIS is out to kill people. The Muslims are going to kill all the white ones. All this is going on, Kahi. Your sweet words won't save you. They'll come here and boot the hell of you out. Because they say their law is higher than what law you got. What law you got, Kahi? Sweet words on Facebook? Nothing else. Just walk around, strut around and write some words. That's all you can do. It's got no mana in it. Nothing. No substance, nothing. Just please people. There's nothing anybody can do, Kahi. I'm just telling you, I'm just directing these Paramount Chiefs because they are the commercial trading bank owners that make money out of land like everybody that's well off here. And well off, the elite people are making money out of you useless sods. And here I am trying to tell you for all years what to do. What do you do? Give me 10 minutes to talk about all this. 
That's how useless you are in front of a big court and you're just talking about people on the land. That's not going to hold up, okay? Not going to hold up. When I'm talking on it, I shut your mouth because I'm not going to bug around anymore. You put the boot in now and you can't do anything about it legally. I'm doing the legal thing, right? Those other Maoris that I contracted under a contract to take Cook Street fucked it up and got us locked in prison. Well, they're going to get the bill from me, okay? And anybody that steps in the road up on them Marae up there in front of the Paramount Chiefs and Kingi, you're going to get a boot up because your government here can't take their names off my side. Try. Try. You know why, Kahi? The Freemasons are saying, don't touch. You know, I wasn't a Freemason follower. In fact, I was the opposite. But the, the reason of Mohi saying, don't listen to you lot, and Machi Tarawa says, don't listen to that lot, and then Dave saying, don't listen to that lot. And all the other Maoris saying, don't listen to that other one. Don't listen to him. Don't listen to anybody. You know what? All of you had no mana. Mohi had it. He has the title to this country and the Pacific Islands and all the nations in the world under the native title is the Manukau Company title in, Glasgow, in Edinburgh. Scotland. Freemasons. Okay, you, you got that? Are you listening or is it going in there and out there in a puff of wind? Okay, you're buggered, Kahi, and your useless lot up there who took their emails off their 70, 85 emails and you said you'll be glad to take your email off. Yeah, I was going to take it but I'm leaving it there so that you can pick up the stuff and learn some fucking thing. And I know you're just taking the bits out of it and putting nice words there to make it look like you're clever. Well, you're not clever, Kai. You're fucking dumb. I'll tell you straight to your face on this video. You're fucking dumb. Dumb. To not know how land titles work. You think you just can live on the land and the big boys will come along and boot you off. You know why? Because they've got titles. The church has got title in Tiki Tiki, 1831 title, St. Mary's Church on my fucking land. See, they went for me and my family because we're fucking honest. Right? You, you, you bastards are scrapping up there, killing everybody, killing all your Manukau's Moriori people, but you couldn't get him. You couldn't get him. A lot have tried to shut him down, shut me down. And just as well he's right in the church was there to push things along. And I went along with them because they were political, apolitical. They had all these things set up. But they had this key real estate bank key missing. I've got it. Okay, I've got the key to the whole fucking world. Well, right here. Right? And you think I'm just playing around when I say I'm going to England to go straight into Westminster with this flag? Because you bastards don't know how to use it. You don't know what it is. You don't know what it means. All you would do with it is just run up and down the road. That's what I'm saying. You're too lazy to learn what it means because it wasn't yours in the first place. Right? It wasn't your place to say anything in the first place. You belong to this idea with these crooked pirates in Wellington. I'm saying it for all the people in this country. You stay on that side with the roughnecks and the fraud corrupted John Key and Bill English, the Matai man, the chiefly man, white man in Samoa, him and his thugs on this side with Queen Elizabeth II, crooked sod that's abandoned you fellas in New Zealand. You got no seal because I went to prison, come out, and the judge, I said you got no seal, no queen, 
no authority over me, no jurisdiction, no nothing. Just a whim, Kahi. That's all you've got. You and your Maori have got fuck all. And here, these paramount chiefs, I don't know how much, how, how, how much swearing I do, the truth is picked out amongst the swear words. The truth. Deeds of truth. You have no truth, Kahi, to put against what I've got. <clears throat> That's why I tell you, shut your mouth if you've got no titles. Money's got the title. Bunny's got a title. And Heriwini Karaka, or Selwyn Clark's got the other title. Those three I've appointed because I know who's got titles. Kahi, you've got fuck all. Just your big mouth and your family's big mouth on this side, thinking you've got the power over this lot and me. Hmm? It makes sense or no sense to you? For you, you call me a bore. Boring about what? Truth or fake fraud? When you say you're bored, it, it shows you have no high intelligence, but none on the side, sitting on the sideline, waiting for me to say something so that you can pick off it and feed it on this side like the rest of you thugs. I call you a thug, Kahi, because anybody that goes against this side is a thug on this side. You're following the legacy of thugs and pirates of New South Wales government and New Zealand Crown government and John Key's Panama Papers. You're all full of shit. There, shove that up. I don't care what people say about me. That's the truth. I got my rep reputation. I talk like that for shitheads like you. Shitheads like all the shitheads in Maori who are fake names. Harawera is no name. It's homemade out of mud. Like your mother said, we come from the earth. A bit of mud in the gum fields. That's, 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 that's you. Your mama said it. Your mama said it. You come out of the earth. Yeah, well, where's the heart of it a bit? Where, where, where's the heart of it a bit? Where, 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 where's the head feel bit? Tell us the truth. Or shut your fucking mouth. You lot, and all the rest. Peter Peroni, shut your fucking mouth. Right? Bryce, Bryce Smith is going to get rid of you. Off the trust on the other side. Because you know what? I'll support him to do that. You and this Tiwana Tibble that was running CEO of this Ngāti Whātua Ōraki trustees. They're going to boot you lot. The other one's got more right to that land over there because Mohi said, Mohi Manika said, the other one has got more right, Tamata Kapua and Ihenga, the explorer. That's his land at Rangitoto in Oraki. Right? It's a Manika land, but that, that, that's their land. Because I listen to what Mohi says. I've got it all over here. you got stuff all to talk about, Kahi. You have no place to say anything on any land. That's why you're stupid to say, oh, the land, everybody's on the land, da-da-da. But you've got no title. You just thin air words on this side. All this stuff here is homemade with a fake queen that has no coronation, fake scone, fake everything, fake you and your Mary is a patent word, copyright word of the Crown Corporation, private Crown Corporation, New South Wales government and Queen Victoria. All fake. That's why you won't get anywhere with this lot. You won't get anywhere. You're going to get a bill. All you lot that jumped out of the emails onto this side, you're going to get the bill. You know what? 
one trillion pounds each on that side. Only a bunch of people on this side. Kahi, I'll kick you on that side when I'm finished with you because I'm not going to give you any more information by email because your little brain, pea brain, will pick at it and put things on Facebook that are not true. Those people, I'm telling you people that are commenting on Kahi, Kahi, Harawara side, he's got nothing to stack up behind what he says because he's pinching it off my side and the videos he's watching. Right? I put the videos there for people to learn who's who and identify yourself. Owner, tell the truth and don't fake because you'll get banged up with this lot. They're going to bang the whole lot of the lords, kick them out because we already have a king. We're going to get rid of your queen, Kahi, you will have fahu. You'll have to listen to these guys because They've got the right to boot you lot off because you only occupy that land. You haven't got the title. You're only occupying it. Because if you don't like you, you gotta go. Somewhere else. Okay? You can't go on that to Timorai. That's corporate on this side. Trustees. Legal landowners are fuck all. Okay? The real owners is these paramount chiefs. That's it. Whatever they say goes. What I say goes. Okay? I'll have the last say with the banks. The Moai Powerhouse Bank on their side and in Britain on that flag is already set up. It's taken me over 20 years to set this up, Kahi. It wasn't bought yesterday. It wasn't bought yesterday. I put it through with all the chiefs and went right through them. I was there at their meetings, the Confederation of Chiefs, 1835, and then the 1834. I was there at those meetings. So I know the whole of Ngāpui back to front, all of Te Arawa back to front, Waikato back to front, and the Moriori Manukau back to front. So don't tell me to sit on the sideline, lady. You shut your fucking mouth, and a lot of you other Maoris up there, shut your mouth. Because what I do, I'm giving it back to all the people who are on this side, right through the world. You idiot. You can't see the dust from the clouds. You can stay there and shut your mouth on that piece of land you're just sitting on. That's all you got. The bit under your foot can slide away from you. If I say so, don't argue, Kahi, because what I say goes. The sheriff will come and deal with it on the commercial level and the native level because you haven't got a native title of your own. No one has the native title on their own under this system. Only this side, straight from Britain, that rules these lands and rules all over the world where the Queen has gone and ripped it for her own self-interests and you dead lot of parts. Okay, you got that? So, Manahi was in a bad uh, reception. He had to go out in the cold to talk because I texted him to go outside but he went outside to ring me and I wasn't there twice today. And so, um, it's very difficult because he's busy as well. And I was waiting for uh, Bundy to ring me back. Uh, but um, this is for Dorothy. Dorothy, I assume you'll ring me up. And if it's true, Bundy, no, sorry. I'm only dealing with these Paramount Chiefs and nobody else, no third party. This is the first party, the second party, and nobody else. It's going to, it's, I'm going to talk to nobody else because I don't want any third parties in this business. I've got Jamie back now. She's, I trust her. I trust her, even though I had a bit of a hard time with her. But she knows everything that I'm teaching her. And I don't want this going haywire again. I want somebody right next to me or nothing. I'll do it myself.
I'm doing everything myself, Dorothy. Nothing wrong with you. You can work with whoever up there, but I'm dealing with those three paramount chiefs and nobody else. I'm on the King's job. I'm using King's people, the people that I appoint, straight to Britain. Nobody's in this. No one else that I'm not comfortable with. I've forgiven you, but you haven't forgiven me. I'm saying I let things go because you were mixed up with that Mike Diamond. Shut your fucking mouth and keep out of my road. Because you sent me an email and tried to force one on me and cheeky little sod back here try to make me frightened. No, or make you frightened. You just shut your fucking mouth. You've got no title, nothing. And you crooked me. And you're on record, on the police record file. <coughs> and Paul Tiffany pulled off because I didn't want him having anything to do to prop you fellas up. No, I'll deal with this straight to Britain myself, without you lot. I don't trust any legal system here because I've exhausted everything and including Cook Street, the legal system has failed. The justice system in this country has failed and it needs booting out. I'm going to boot them out with these paramount chiefs, the landowners. These are the commercial landowners as well as the native landowners. They now have the ruling authority of a king running this country with my direction and the bank, the Maui Powerhouse Bank, behind them. Okay? They are only just this country and the rest of the other countries in the 250 countries comes under this flag. It's that British side of the flag that I'm controlling from that end. And here is one 250th part of a claim of rest of the countries that are going to be credited with the mobile phone. Credited to pay out what I recover. I don't need any land. Kahi Harawera. I've already got 38 land blocks down the East Cape. That's we're going to build on. Whatever. And show me how many you've got. That's the Rogan Wanua family. Down there, the judges in the native court, Whakawhikira, native court, that's a native court. We've got our own native court, okay, and the title to Mount Hikarangi and Aoraki Mountain down the South Island, and Desmond Wano is down there with the crown on his fucking head. You hear me? He's, what, he's got the Moko Nui to Rapa Nui, Moai statue in Dunedin with the crown on his head. That's a real crown, not this bullshit crown of yours, made of metal. Okay, that got you on these lands. You got on these lands because of that crown, the bullshit one. Right? And that came out of this side, the King William, the King William the Third and Fourth title. And Ernest Augustus the First titles. How dare you and your family run this country into the swamp with this lot and Bill English and your Maori party and your Maori party and all the rest of the useless sides. I've got a party here, the Maui King William party here for this country and the Commonwealth Federal State Government of the World. You silly sides. I had it all the time and you fellas just turned off your ears. Nothing in your blocky. Well, want to know anything because you're stuck in your colonial heads on this side, screwed up, lost identity, lost tribes of Israel, lost everything, and fighting your way out of it, going nowhere. 183 years you've been subject these parliamentaries into brainwashing on this side, you fucking lot, okay, and you marry lot. I'm saying to the world, your, your own biggest enemy is yourselves that work with the government, colonial government in Australia, thugging the place out and the world. Over here in Waitangi Marae, 
hiding the Queen's business in there, screwing all the people in this country and all the native countries in the world. Screwing the whole lot of them. You fucking cunts. Huh? I say that on the video because everybody's listening. That's how I talk on Facebook, right back to 2008. I've been swearing all the way through. You can pick out all the bad bits. That's for you. All the bad bits I swear about is for you and your family and all you immigrants. Right? I just come here and immigrants come here because this lot of thugs let them in. This side let those thugs in to try and cover up and get rid of this lot. This lot's going to beat the shit out of you. They're going to beat you up right through the world. This flag's going to beat you up and beat you Maoris off it and leave it alone because it's not your Maori flag. You stick with your stupid Tinoranga Teratanga flag. Red and black. Bad colours. Black is a bad colour. The black strip on this flag is for Satan. You're the fucking Satan on that side. Not this side. This side. That black strip around that cross is to keep you Satan fuckers out. That's what it is. That's what it is. It's a military to blow the shit out of you. Off the fucking land. Kahi, I'm telling you straight to your face, in front of all the mouths in this country, to shut your fucking mouth once and for all. We get rid of the whole lot of you and the Queen, your Queen, and your 